What's up, beauty babes? Today I'll be testing two lip kits that are both under five dollars. I'm really excited to try these. One reason is because my mom bought this like six, seven, almost a year ago, and she still hadn't tried it. She's like, I'm gonna try it when <laughs> she has never tried this and i'm really excited to try this for myself i can't wait any longer to try this song and try it and we also have the same same situation she bought this never tried it and um <laughs> i'm waiting to try it so this one is five for bucks and this one is four bucks so i'm really excited to try these so let's get right into it and i'm going to start off with this one we're going to save the glitter for last we have to have a strategy because we don't want to Oh, I didn't expect that. I thought I was going to open it. Okay. <laughs> I didn't expect it to directly come off. But we're going to do this one last because glitter is a pain. So, yes. But this is the Jasmine Labelle Cosmetics. And it is the All About Lips collection. It comes with the lip balm. Lip balm. Balm. <laughs> so, I almost said balm. You, you get my point. Lip balm, velvet gloss, high shine lip gloss, and a glitter gloss. So this is the velvet. Oh, they say it on there. Huh? So velvet, high shine, and the glitter. So I'm gonna swatch these all on my lips. So let me attempt to open this painfully. <laughs> As always. Can I open it from the bottom? I'm pretty sure I can. I never can. See, one thing I always struggle with is opening boxes that have tape on them because they act like they want to put the world's strongest tape. It's like, it don't cough on it. You can see when people are opening because it's so loud. <laughs> All right, so let me start off with the cute lip balm that won't come out the package. Look at that. That is so cute. Like, oh my God. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, it should stick to my lip. <laughs> Doesn't stick. It's okay. All right, let me go ahead and test this out. Oh, nice little color. That's nice. I wonder if it will. Oh, that's creamy. Okay. Oh. Oh, it smells like. It smells like strawberries. It smells good. It feels great. I think I'm going to keep it. <laughs> Just because I'm out of chapstick. That's another reason I didn't use it oh lip balm and chapstick are totally different things so i realized lip balms are dyed way more creamier and these are more like a lip gloss it just literally feels like i'm wiping lip gloss on my lips right now literally because <laughs> it feels like sticky and at least it smells good i can say but you know it'll be a nice lip balm keep my lips from getting dry. Very nice lip balm. Love it. Group. Nice. Moving on. <laughs> Nothing special about lip balms except for these cute little lips that are on it. That's just that's just adorable. That's just so cute. All right, my lips are moisturized, so let's get into the actual glosses. So first I'll start, you know, shortest to tallest. <laughs> Why not? Oh my god, sorry for the loud noise. It just stuck to the package. Okay, so first we'll be testing out this cute little velvet lip gloss. I have started to grow on the nude colors. I love nudes and they're they're growing on me. <laughs> so uh ooh. Okay, this is smooth. The brush is really soft. Really nice. Okay, love it. And I think this is a deal because you're getting four things for four dollars. And if you go to the Dollar Tree and you get four things, it'll be way over like it'll be like six dollars yeah it'd be like no actually like five dollars try something still you know they had 25 cents you know <laughs> so dollar 25 sugar now so just letting you know you can't get things for a dollar this is actually the better deal this when you add tax and all that so yeah <laughs> okay so this overall is a nice color i really do love nudes so one thing i do not do is wear nudes by itself i have to mix it because otherwise it looks so weird just so weird to me <laughs> uh but i usually mix this with a light red or something to make it like a nice nudish pinkish hue <laughs> but i think it feels really soft i'm not gonna lie it's like this is a really nice velvet gloss because my mom she does like velvet glosses and i can tell you what really nice all right let me go like this off real quick 
So you can move on to the next one, which will be the High Shine Lip Gloss. And this one's in a bronzish red color. It's very, very pretty. I quite enjoy this color. I'm just trying to make sure I get it all of it off. <laughs> so this is the High Shine. A little taller than the other one, as you can tell. <laughs> very cute. All right, let's see how this looks on my lips. Uh, <laughs> it's not that it's not that. it's literally a rustic color it's very light too which is quite surprising high shine and it actually feels like the velvet one strangely lurking eye emoji <laughs> it really does i think it's the brush that's giving me this illusion because this brush is so soft <laughs> oh comes with lint though no i ain't pay for that <laughs> okay it's good oh good no no okay okay cool <laughs> all right really nice color very shiny well somewhat it says a high shine and it's not that shiny the only reason if it will be in the shiny category is just because it has glitter in it i want a high shine lip gloss that literally like it's shiny it doesn't even have to have glitter i got one over there it is so shiny and you don't even need like anything it's just super shiny it doesn't even have glitter in it it feels great with overall i could say it's it feels great but it's not giving me the super shiny vibes it promised so it's it's fine you know it has some sparkle in it it's very cute i could say i'll wear this on casual times but overall <laughs> no because <laughs> it, it almost looks like the same color as my lip just with bronze specks in it not that desirable of a color okay <laughs> all right but skipping that the last one we shall try is this glitter gloss it is very pretty i can say you know nice glitter you can never have too many glitter products not gonna lie we have another one like this except for it's more of a goldish color you know variety <laughs> i forgot what i was gonna say the variety is unreal oh my god it is so sherry oh my god okay so this would be something you put on top of, like your red lipstick or your pink lipstick or you know anything <laughs> This is what I'm putting on top of my black lipstick to make it shiny and super glittery. See, I like the glitters, the lip glosses with the tiny specks of glitter. And just like a lot of it too. Because some of them, they said they're glittery, but they're, they don't have that much glitter in it. Just be real. <laughs> they just don't. But this one has so much glitter in it. And just like with eyeshadows, you can build. I'm putting it on Nestle just so... You know, you can see it. I'm not trying to look cute. So I'm just trying to, you know, wear it so you can see. It. Mm. Look how shiny that is. That is so shiny. I can't believe it. Like, oh my God. Very pretty. Very shiny. I'm loving it. Ba -dum -ba -ba -ba. <laughs> so these overall, I could say out of a 10, I'll give it a 7 out of 10. Most of them felt like the same. This one, I can say, is one of my favorites. These come second, and the high shine comes last. Very good. They all feel super soft. Just I look like a more variety of a color. This one, when that high shine, that's probably the only thing that killed it. The first one, you know, it's nude. It's fine. Simple. You know, you can get those anywhere. <laughs> and the brushes are great, though. So I can bump it up to an 8. You know, 8 out of 10. Brushes are great. And with that concluded, the bomb, of course, I'm keeping that, <laughs> that out the way. We're going to bring this in the way. This is the Max Makeup Shuri Moya, Shuri Moya, Shuri Moya, Cherry Moya. <laughs> read, read it. Just, just read it. Like, does that say Shuri Moya? Cherry Moya? You probably can't tell. I don't know if it's mirrored or not, but you, you get my point. Cherry Moya? sherry moya i don't know <laughs> but we got this set okay it has a lip liner and 
lip liner creamy gel lipstick which is the glitter and it also has a cute little lip brush so that is really nice i think i'm excited to finally try this it's been way too long and i'm starting to grow on red lipstick this is even perfect oh my god because we originally bought this for my mom because i didn't like red lipstick that much <laughs> but i'm now starting to grow on it and i'm I'm quite proud, you know. <laughs> I'm quite proud. <laughs> so I'm really excited to try this. So let me go ahead and bust her open. Come on. Got it. All right. This is pretty. Oh, yeah. That is such uh, a cute little pot. Like, look at that so cute then we have the, it's so much more vibrant now that it's out you know it's been rusting in here so it's been waiting to did i miss something oh it came off because it's two percent cheap okay cool um is it supposed to be like that oh no i think it's supposed to be like that is it oh, okay we're not gonna talk about it <laughs> i think i can dip my brush in here i think it's supposed to be like that okay um this is nice <laughs> i'm so thrilled right now okay let's just go ahead and start following the instructions line your lips put the glitter on got you all right so we got the little brush right here very nice very small i think this is so you can dip our brush in maybe 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 oh is it is it true or am i just literally messing up this container or something I'm not sure if I'm messing it up or... Oh, I'm messing it up. Okay, I'm not supposed to do that. This is not intended for that. I think this was broken. <laughs> I think the back of it's broken. I'm like, am I doing it right? Am I using it for what it was intended for? But me realizing this is a lip liner and all our lip liners are chalky and hard. And I'm, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not sure what's up with this top though. We're, we're not going to talk about that. We're just going to... Oh. My bad. <laughs> okay, so let's just line the lips and act like I didn't just nearly mess up this whole kick. All right, so first line the lips with the red. Ooh, it's nice and soft. Sometimes it can be a little too soft. Sometimes it can be a little too soft, but it's not too bad. But I can say it's not as red as I expected it to be. It's more like a a light red. Nearly pink to be exact. But you know what? I get what you get. It was four dollars. Five dollars? Something like that. <laughs> what was it? Only four dollars, you know. You get what you get. <laughs> All right. I think that is the worst lining I've ever seen, and it'll do. <laughs> it'll do. It uh, did. All right. And I guess I blend in the leftover. You know, I don't line my lips much, so no one judge me, okay? All right. Cool. Now we use this dip brush <laughs> to dip into the gold oh it has foil protectant okay okay you know luxury <laughs> and now we're just gonna cover our lips with the glitter which is just the main whole point of this video was to try this one glitter really honestly oh she is runny oh she's thick okay she's actually kind of okay it's okay it was runny it's nice it's pretty okay let's see how this is gonna work okay all right we grab some oh it's okay okay i'm excited okay it was a lot more than i expected okay so we're just gonna work this on it's so shiny and red oh no i got it on the table no I'm saying it so sarcastically in a way because, like, the table is meant for it. <laughs> okay, it's very shiny. So... Okay. <laughs> I don't know what to say. It's just shiny. It's pretty. Okay, it's way more liquidy than I thought it'd be. Not gonna lie. I don't know what I expected from you, like, a sl like a Play-Doh and you just mold it on your lips. It's I'm not gonna lie. It's kind of what I expected. <laughs> Don't know why. Just dumb things from my dumb child. Dun -dun 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 -dun. So today's episode on dumb things from a dumb child, we test out a lipstick that actually doesn't look too bad in the end. It's very pretty. 
I think I'll use it for special events. And I think you need to use a good amount, I guess, to sort of build it up. I guess. <laughs> okay, it looks good. It looks G double O D. I like it. I like it a lot. It's so shiny. It's like I think I can build this up all day. But in in to conclude this video. This is so shiny and so pretty. I love it. That lip liner, though, brings it down to a 9 out of 10. That was so useless. I'm telling you, this is not even that bright. It's not even that pigmented. It's not even that thick. It's really too soft and sort of chalky in a way. But, oh my god, do I feel like a luxury right now. <laughs> it is so freaking shiny. And it's way softer than I thought. I love this. It is so pretty. Like, wow. You can get this. Forget this. Get this. Oh my god. It's so nice. I love it. So guys, this was testing beauty products. <laughs> this was testing under $5 lip products. And of course, I like them all. They're really nice. I would definitely use this one more though. This is really good. We finally tried it, guys. Finally, after a year, I'm happy. I It lived up to expectations, I'm telling you. I'm really excited. Really enjoyed it, and I hope you guys enjoyed it, too. Hit the like button, subscribe, and I love you guys. <laughs> Bye.